the control we have over our children diminishes as time passes. When they were little, we decided everything for them, including their name and what they would wear and what they would eat. As they grew older, they decided what they wanted to wear and they chose what they wanted to eat. And they made tantrums at the age of three and four and two because they did not want to eat what we gave them. Look at how Allah is taking away the control that he gave you over your child slowly but surely. And as the child grows older, they refuse some of the toys that we buy for them. They want something more sophisticated. They become more and more complex. And then they refuse to go to the college that we have chosen for them. And ultimately they refuse to marry the person we are trying to tell them to marry. You know, before father used to say, son, I found someone for you. Son used to say, mashallah, alhamdulillah. Today, son, found someone for you. Dad, I already found someone before you did. <laughs> Subhanallah. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala safeguard us. This is life and this is how things are. So we need to guide the children how to choose a spouse because they need to know that when you get into high school, you don't go into high school to look for a spouse, but rather you go in order to study. Subhanallah. When you go into university, Subhanallah, you go there to work. You are, you should be focused. Yes. If you do happen to come across someone, your parents should be the first people that you communicate with. The 